if you are a new developer like i would say ecmascript the specs which are there you may not have to worry too much about it just yet like learn javascript as a language first learn the paradigm very well and then worry about like what are the deep level discussion that are happening in the spec world and slowly and consistently jump into it like don't try to do everything up front because then you'll just overload yourself you know make too many mistakes waste a lot of time so start with maybe something a little simpler like mdn docs or maybe like you don't know javascript book series learn them very well and then use them in your day to day as you start like building up on your knowledge about the spec itself super yeah that that's a, that's a cool thing but uh, still saying that if people want to know like what exactly the sigma script is and how it is related to javascript like, like, like what's the answer for that um, um. Um, I can answer it if you yeah, want. Yeah, sure, but, um, yeah. So ECMAScript is a specification of the language. So ECMAScript defines like how does, for example, the triple equal to uh, operator would behave, and JavaScript is an implementation of that specification. So similarly, uh, there exists. there existed in the past or maybe it exists right now. There's come something called as Action Script, which was popularized by uh, Adobe Flash. So that language is also. based on the ecmascript specification so ecmascript is like a parent specification and javascript is the concrete implementation of that specification so yes you need to learn javascript but if you are stuck if you want to understand the deeper mechanisms of how a certain thing behaves in java you need to look at the specification for deeper understanding so that's the difference between the two super hey charlie so i think uh, you you have a very uh, deep journey with the javascript so let's say a engineer who wants to contribute to the spec like is there a way like a engineer can contribute to the ecma script spec um like how i've never tried i think isn't there a, like the is the w3c group uh, part of uh, trying to put this uh, this specs together i know that in general when it comes to contributing to a language there is a way to contribute um to it but i'm not part of the w3c group so i'm not sure but i think that in general a lot of the specs are on github as well and you can kind of like read and be part of discussions and propose some edits uh things like that it usually looks quite scary uh to be a part of this but it's something i'm actually interested in in doing so even if you know uh you have the answer to this question <laughs> feel free to like share it